That's right. They came up with an agenda to push the type of hip hop content that they're pushing for a purpose, for intent. And you have to understand this. Be very fucking clear on this motherfucking point right here. Don't twist this shit up when you leave out of here. Google it. Right. Who propagates all the fucked up hip hop content we get today? Corporations. 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 Right. Black corporations in particular. Yeah. Black, black entertainment television. Right. Who oh my God. White people. White people. White people. MTV. White MTV. White people. Viacom. Clear Channel Radio was not owned by Viacom. A Texas no. But this is how this shit all ties together. Uh. The Vanguard Group. Uh -huh. yeah. The Vanguard Group owns Viacom. That's right. And they manage all of Clear Channel's accounts. That's yeah. right. And they take the money from those corporations uh -huh. and they invest that shit in Corrections Corporation of America and the Geo Group, the two largest prison building companies in the world. This is what they do with the money. So the largest shareholders in the prison industrial complex is the Vanguard Group. The Vanguard Group that's propagating all this go to jail music. Why the fuck are they promoting go to jail music? Because they make money while sending motherfuckers to jail. You gotta understand this shit. Make that true. It's really fucking clear. This ain't no shit. They're not hiding this shit from you. No. They not hiding. They never hit the truth. You just weren't interested. Motherfuckers just ain't interested. But the truth has always been there. They're fucking building prisons and sending our babies to fucking prison because they're making money off. Think about this shit. How many schools they closed down in Philly? Holy shit. Too many. Too many. New York, same thing. Chicago, same thing. Trenton, New Jersey, same thing. Newark, Patterson, Newark, California. Every fucking weird is a black community. They shutting down schools. Why they shutting down schools? They don't want people to learn. And why is that a better investment? They don't make money off you being educated. They make money off you going to prison. They make sixty thousand dollars a year on average per prisoner per year. Sixty thousand dollars a year. They can send every motherfucking kid in the ghetto to college at Princeton University for that fucking money. But they would rather lock you the fuck up. That's right. Think about that shit. Every time the black community get up and protest and march for more funding for the inadequate schooling, this fucking apartheid school system. Yeah. When we protest, the whole motherfucking middle class white community seems to get the fuck up and go all the way to the Supreme Court to stop. Fuck. Uh -huh. Why? They're like, no, we don't want your children to get the same funding that our children in Princeton get. Princeton University, Princeton High School, $24,000 a student. Trenton, $11,000. Yeah. Right. Right? They don't want the equal funding. Why don't they want the equal funding? They're like, yo, we don't want to give up that money. That's taxpayers' money. You're infringing on our rights. That's socialism. That's bullshit because they're not complaining about the $60,000 a year they give up to send these same kids to fucking prison. Motherfuckers, man. By the age of 13, we have an encounters with the penal system. Right. 12, 13 year olds and shit. Just recently, they fucking ran a fucking six year old black boy across the fucking concrete and bruised his fucking face all up and handcuffed him and every fucking thing. Right. For no fucking reason. Said they thought he stole a fucking bike. Oh, wow. Six years old. Come on, man. Yeah. They're putting us on a direct path from the cradle to the prison pipeline. Yep, yep. And you gotta know this shit, you gotta fucking see this shit. Look at the fucking drug statistics. White America do more fucking drugs than black America per capita. They do more fucking drugs than any of us. A lot of fucking drugs we use, they introduced that shit to us. At one time that shit was called a white man's high because we couldn't afford it. Wow. Right? Wow. But they over policing our communities to send our babies to fucking jail. Police are getting grants from the same fucking prison companies to arrest motherfuckers in my ghetto. Hmm. Every fucking day, they get raises and promotions based on how many drug arrests they make. Motors. So they locking us up for fucking consensual adult activity. A motherfucker wanna smoke weed and self-medicate and another motherfucker wanna sell it to him, leave him the fuck alone. That's right. 